Hello everybody, back here again for another vlog a day, and today is Monday the 16th, and today was a lovely, beautiful day to be alive. Got up this morning, <coughs> fairly early, got the dog out, got that all taken care of, wife got off to work without any real incident. I did jump in the hot tub for a little bit, got my soak in, and then hung around for the morning. Did not have King, who usually comes on Mondays, I'd say probably, I don't know, 48 Mondays a year. He would come over and he's not coming now because he's going to the boyfriend's house and staying there all week while she travels for work so working out good for them so it's kind of different not having him here he's like i said he's usually here a lot so but yeah me and luna just hung out um got a few things done nothing too major i was out of chlorine for my pool so i needed to go pick up some chlorine um, from the supply shop i get it from it's a plumbing supply it also does pool stuff so I figured I better get some more chlorine in it because my wife said we're having tadpoles in our pool and I do not want to mess with that stuff. So I can't imagine they could live in a pool with chlorine, but apparently they can. So I gotta get some more chlorine in it and then see what other chemicals I need to help solve that. So I went ahead and decided to take the truck just to like put the chlorine jug in the back because no matter how much they say they rinse them off, there's always chlorine on the outside of them that leaks and it'll ruin your carpet and all kinds of stuff in your car. So went ahead, went in there, dropped my jug off, got my new jug headed out and then um, decided to head on over to tractor supply looking for one of those seven foot tall um, skeleton roosters don't know why i want it but i want one of those and they haven't got but a couple in already and they sell out virtually immediately so but i figured it's worth a shot um go check it out it wasn't there went around the store a little bit ended up finding a couple extra dog bones for luna because i'm going to be taking off sometime most likely thursday while my wife's at work and then i'll give her a new fresh smoked meaty bone so she'll have a little extra something to keep herself entertained while my wife's at work then same thing friday morning my wife will give her the second new bone so she has something a little extra a little to entertain her i guess is the best way to put it so she's used to being at home while the owner's at the office all day as well so it's not like it's in the world for her but normally here she either has other dogs and or people to play with kind of thing so definitely uh, want to give her something a little extra to entertain her mind while we're gone so but yeah i went from there also reached out one of my clients was having trouble finding somebody to watch their dog this weekend that they trusted they said they had a couple people that, that might work but they really didn't trust that much and i said well if they want to drop off friday morning i said i don't want friday morning because one, my wife will already be at work by the time you get here i'll be gone and then on top of that i have two dogs who get along splendidly stuck in the house by themselves all day doesn't do any benefit to be here so as far as if you can find somebody that can drop the dog off friday after work like 6 p.m then karen will watch the dog all weekend because she'll be home all weekend with the dogs and the dogs are going great she loves that dog as well so that'll be no problem at all so she agreed that would work she reached out and said she did find somebody who could bring the dog over late friday so we're all good with it and then we went ahead got back from the store put the bones up kind of hit them from her so she doesn't know they're there hung out had a couple things to do did some yard work got a few other things accomplished went to get my run in and on my run just like today i'm making my vlog and i was going down the street heading south here and a guy pulled out of a driveway from the west backing out he's backing east but coming out of a west side driveway and he backed out like a foot into the street and stopped and I swear he looked right at me. I was like, okay, while well, I'm making my vlog. So if you look at yesterday's vlog, you'll see me yell at a guy for almost running me over in a truck. And then he backed up some more. As I got closer behind him, I was walking by. And I thought, damn, you're kind of like in a hurry. Just fucking wait. Like, I'm walking by here. Clearly you saw me. And I thought, well, he thinks he can stop before he gets to me. It's no big deal. As I was getting, I was getting just about out of his way. And he cranked the wheel like full left. And then started backing up even more. So now he's like heading right at me. So I kind of jumped forward. So I missed so he wasn't going to hit me. But I smashed the side of his truck with my hand real hard. Scared the living shit out of him, which was completely my goal, 100%. So, and then yelled at the guy. Like, that was not fun. But he got pulled back in the driveway and jumped out. He, thought, he actually thought he hit me, which is the reason I hit the truck. Because if I just yelled at him, like, hey, watch out, it wouldn't have nearly as long-lasting effect of, look where you're backing up, as thinking he just ran over somebody would have that feeling. And it was an old Chevy truck. It's a big old panel on the side of the bed. And I hit it hard. Like my hand hurt after I hit it. And it rattled and made a lot of noise. So I went bow, 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 hit like three times real loud. So he really thought he ran me over. But that's good. I wanted him to be scared. So 
but yeah, I got back from my run, um, went ahead, had a couple things else to get done. Uh, wife got home from work, and I was doing a few little things here and there, getting my um, trip to Iowa kind of planned out in my head, and I'm not sure exactly what I'm leaving 100%, but figuring out what I'm taking and what I'm packing and what I'm going to pack. And temperature's already getting down to like the 40s up there already, so I got to take some pants, which I don't know where they're at. I got to find my pants. Worst case scenario, I'll just go buy some pants when I get up there because it is what it is. But went ahead and said the hell with it. So there's that stupid house with the security system that has the cameras and tells you you're on recording everything while I'm in the street. And like, they must get so many notifications because cars go by and they'll set off. Like, what's the use of having it if it goes off 24 seven? But oh well, people are weird. So yeah, I went ahead and got a couple other things done. Um, got back from my run, grabbed a shower, threw in some of the coconut butter shrimp. Or maybe it's just butter shrimp, not coconut, just butter shrimp. And had some leftover rice, knocked that out. Realized we sat down to eat, forgot to make a vegetable. And I apologize to my wife. She goes, I didn't tell you to make a vegetable. I'm like, okay, do you want one? So it's like eight minutes to make a frozen vegetable. She goes, no, that's fine. So we just ate our butter, shrimp, and rice. No vegetables this time. So watched a little bit of Sheldon and then headed back outside. Played out in the yard with the dog for a little bit. Watched her chase lizards all over hell and back. I went ahead and put some chlorine in the pool as well. And hopefully that'll help solve that problem. But it was funny because I didn't see any tadpoles in there when I was there looking before I put the chlorine in. So I don't know if she scooped them all out with the net or what was going on there. So yeah, who knows? Hopefully they're gone and they don't come back. So this is what it is. Now I got the ladder set up. Hopefully my wife will use it a little more often since it's um, set up properly and it's comfortable. She can get them out of it easily. Not worry about it having problems. So, but yeah, other than that, it was pretty much same old, same old. Um, got a couple other things done here and there. Nothing major. Headed back in, had myself a little snack and watched some Fraser to wrap up the night. So that's all I got for right now. We'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.